Oh, hi, what's high? I'm Mr. Beats, and I'll tell you what's high the life expectancy in Japan. The oldest living person in the world currently is Kane Tanaka, a Japanese resident who is 118 years old. Here is a picture of her at 20 years old. Yeah, that picture was taken in 1923. Feel young yet? Kane has said she credits family, sleep, hope, eating good food, and practicing math problems is all the reasons why she has lived so long. But here's the thing, it's not just Kane sticking around for a long time in Japan. This seems to be a trend there. The average lifespan there is currently 84.3. That's the highest of all countries in the entire world. For females in Japan, it's an astonishing 86.9. There are now more than 80,000 Japanese residents who are older than 100. Okinawa, Japan has the highest number of residents over 100 in the world as well as the lowest risk of age-related diseases. So why is the life expectancy so high in Japan? Diet and exercise, duh. But actually, no. There is some evidence that suggests that they don't necessarily exercise more in Japan compared to other countries. And while diet is a major factor, it's not the only one. Here are the major reasons why the life expectancy is so high in Japan. Number one, they never really retire. Older folks in Japan tend to live with more purpose after they retire. They tend to be more involved in the local community, spend more time around younger family members, and work by choice rather than economic necessity. They also tend to stay active. Number two, they prioritize public health. Overall, Japan has invested heavily in public health over hundreds of years. From childhood vaccination programs to universal health care to public service campaigns calling for citizens to regularly check their blood pressure and reduce salt consumption. In Japan, regular checkups are very common. Going back before the 20th century, Japan was ahead of the curve with hygiene, with regular bathing and a clean water supply before it was cool. The indigenous religion of Shinto definitely influenced this call for physical cleanliness, by the way. It's not just personal hygiene. Almost everything in Japan is well known for its cleanliness. Number three, it's all about the social cohesion, baby. Communitarianism is big in Japan. There is a strong group orientation there, which some experts argue gives them a deeper sense of belongingness to society. This gives them higher self-esteem, which in turn gives them a more positive outlook, which ultimately leads to living longer. Number four, there is less of a hierarchy in Japan. A big reason why there is more social cohesion in Japan is because some research shows there is more equality in Japan compared to most other countries. Sure, there are still social hierarchies, but it's more common in Japan for folks at different parts of the hierarchy to regularly interact and be friends with each other. In addition, folks there at different parts of the hierarchy tend to share the same values. Number five. Um, yeah, they eat well. But yeah, a big reason why Japanese residents live longer is because they tend to eat better. At least one study found that there are lower rates of heart disease and cancer there because of a lower intake of red meat. Specifically, Japanese residents tend to eat less saturated fatty acids, but more of the good fatty acids found in fish, plant foods, and green tea. That same study also found lower rates of brain-related diseases due to moderate increases in animal and dairy consumption combined with decreases in salt consumption. Less than 5% of Japanese residents are considered obese. In general, folks in Japan eat more of the healthier meat, more stuff with antioxidants, more fermented foods, and in less portions overall. Basically, they eat more fish, leafy vegetables, and soybean products, and less red meat. Other reasons for such a high life expectancy in Japan 
possibly, include just genetic factors, and obviously Japan just being one of the wealthiest countries in the world overall. But to recap, the big five secrets to longevity in Japan are never really retiring, everyone there being on board with public health, feeling like they belong to a tight-knit community, ignoring the social hierarchy with day-to-day -day interactions, and, oh yeah, eating healthy. So if the rest of the world wants to live longer, we can learn from Japan. The things I do for videos. Hey, and guess what? This video is sponsored by Boxu, a monthly snack box subscription service that delivers original assortments of premium Japanese snacks and tea pairings to your front door. Every month you get a different theme. It's a different snack journey through Japan every month, shipped straight from Japan. And that's what I did. Let's check it out, shall we? Oh, okay, yeah, all right. Premium Japanese snacks. Okay, so uh, here's what we got. Looks like we've got some candy here. This is stuff that I never would have encountered in my life otherwise. Oh, we got some green tea. Hey, that helps you live longer. These probably don't help you live longer, but they look very good. Ooh, you can see here, it's quite the collection of authentic Japanese food. I can't wait to share this with my family. My favorite part here, it comes with a culture guide and has much more information about where all these snacks came from and what they are because a lot of the stuff I, I don't know what they are. So join the thousands of others who have already experienced authentic Japanese flavors. Get 10% off of your own authentic Japanese snack box, and you can save up to $47 by using code MrBeat10 and going to the link in the description box. This also supports my channel. So how long do you want to live? I want to live to 142. But first I gotta get to 42, am I right? <laughs> Anyway, if you're from Japan, I especially want to hear from you. What do you think about all this, eh? Let me know in those comments, and thank you for watching.